Hi, this is a quick review of the Cone Safe Piggy Bank. This is a really nice piggy bank and that's in shape of a safe. It's designed for kids and it's really fun to play with. The unit does require battery in order for you to open it. And uh, I want to show you how it works right now. So in front here, you have this little knob here. This knob will let you turn when you enter the correct code. And you can turn it. Right here, you have the bill feeding slot. And up top here, you have the corn feeding slot. So as you hear, I have some money in there and I was playing with my little kid and he was playing with this thing he really liked. He's only a year and a half and he's already playing with this thing, it's really fun. So uh, at the bottom, you have to take the screw off here to add three AA batteries and after that it's ready to be used. So it comes with a default password and all you have to do is just enter 0000, zero, zero, zero. and you make that noise and when you open it, you make that creaky noise and he really loved that. And inside you can see you have some money that we put in earlier and play around with. And I'll show you what it looks like. So if you leave it open for a while, it will make a beep and let you know that uh, you need to close it. And uh, you can just leave it here for a while here. There you go, see? I switched it to voice mode to show you what it looks like. Go ahead and close it up. And there we go. And when you close it up, it's locked again. So you have to enter the correct code to open it again. You can also change the code. Uh, to change the code, you basically just uh, press the correct code four times, and then all you have to do is hold out this button for a while, and then you enter your new code. There's a little bit of instruction on the box for, to show you how to do this. Anyway, let's try to open it again with the wrong code, for example. Password, please. Password, please. Password, please. Uh oh, sorry. Please try again. See, if you enter the wrong password, that's what happened. And in the voice mode, it's telling you password, please, every time you press the uh, key. In the beep mode, it just beep. So I'm going to try again with the correct code here. Password, please. Password, please. Password, please. There you go. Open it up. So I want to show you what it looks like when it's feeding money. Pretty simple, and it works pretty well so far. We've been playing around with this for a while. There you go. And take the money, and that's it, the light bling, and then it goes away. And you can also drop money from the top in, just like that. And uh, this is the one that he loved the most. He loved playing with this little slot here, dropping a coin down now. Overall, it's a nice little toy for a kid to play with. I think it's um, designed for a little bit older kid, maybe three to five years old, something like that, maybe a little older. Uh, it's a really cool little novelty toy and it works quite well. You do need battery in order to open it, so that's the only downside. So let's say you fill it up and you don't have any batteries, you kind of screw unless you destroy it. So you do have to have battery in order to open it. It's a pretty thick, durable toy. I think my kid throw it around a little bit and nothing happened. But it's definitely not designed for a little taller, so if they throw hard enough on some floor, it might damage it. But so far, okay so far. I hope your short little review helped you in your budget decision. And if you have any questions, please let me know in the comment below. And as always, stay tuned for future review. Thank you.